drama unfolding at a Surfside Commission meeting tonight as another town official announced they're stepping down. And Local 10's Christian Del Rosa live now in Surfside with the latest staff shakeup there. Christian. Well, the latest staff shakeup is the town manager, but this is about what we just witnessed within the past hour, hour and a half. A large member of the police force here showing up at this commission meeting to lash out against the mayor and members of the commission, accusing them of making disparaging comments against them that they claim is raising hostility against them in the community. Questioning again the Surfside Police Department and its ethics. Members of the Surfside Police Department showing a united front in front of their new mayor and commission to call them out on comments. I can assure you that no one will be arrested tonight. I don't want my kid popped. There have been multiple remarks from this commission and the mayor that, ref that reflect poorly and are disparaging to shed a negative light on our police department and its police officers as a whole. The tense exchanges follow the controversial arrest of a political activist for battery on the former vice mayor for the previous administration. The arrest protested by many, calling it political retaliation. The charges were dropped and the police chief at the time is now gone. I'm sure that we can get tons of residents in here that will say how many times the police has cursed at them. There's a better place to do this type of situation, not coming up here and bashing the mayor or trying to get, I, I'm not sure exactly where we're getting with that. The point is, is I get it. You're upset. I'm demanding changes. I'm asking for changes and you don't like it. Okay, so you inflect, you infer, you say things so that people think that I'm against the police. You even said that I talked about defunding the police. You said that. That's the most stupid thing that anybody's ever said. The mayor alluding to changes such as reducing police shifts from 12 hours to eight hours, asking police officers to do away with their dark window tinting and asking officers to wave and smile at residents more often. But members of the police force tell me this has nothing to do with any of that. It has to do with respect. Live in Surfside, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10 News.